Hello everyone, in this video I will show you how to install Windows 11 on a virtual machine or on a virtual box. To install Windows 11 on a virtual box, we simply need for one file, Windows 11 ISO file. To download Windows 11 ISO file, we will open any of the browser here we have Chrome. We will simply open it and we will search for Windows 11 ISO file. On the first link, which is on Microsoft Web, we will click on it. Download Windows 11 ISO file. We will select Windows 11 Multi Edition. Then we will click on Download Now. It will take some time. Then we will select the language. We will select English US and we will confirm it. Again, we have to wait for some time. Here, you can see the links they have provided the links. We will simply click on 64 bit download. Yeah, you can see the download has started. And you can see the size of file is 5.4 GB. So we have to wait for some time. Yes, as you can see, the ISO file has downloaded and you can see the size of this file is 5.6 GB. Now we need to open the virtual box for virtual machine. Simply we will set for virtual box. We have installed Oracle virtual box. This is one of the powerful tools which support any types of operating system. So here we will simply click on new. On the name, we will specify the name Windows 11. Here is the folder that our Windows will be installed on this folder. We will select the ISO file. We will simply click on here on Others, Programs, Windows 11, and we will select this ISO file. Okay, as you can see, Windows 11 is automatically selected Windows 11 Home Edition and uh, the version you can see Windows 11 64 bit so if you want to select username and password you can select it right now password for this one you can select otherwise you can click on here and you can say skip and attempt it installation then in the hardware, you can specify, first of all, you can specify the RAM for uh, this installation. As you can see, our computer has 16 GB RAM, so we can select 4 GB, 5 GB, 12, 12 GB. So for this one, we will select 4 GB. You can see here again, we will select the number of processor, as our computer has 24 CPU. So we will select for CPU, then in the hard drive, according to our hard drive size, so we can select 80 GB, 100 GB, so we will select 80 GB and we will say finish. Once you finish it before starting, once again select this Windows 11, go to setting, on the general tab, on advanced, from here, you select by directional in order to drag and drop between computers and the virtual machine. So we will say OK. Now we will start it. You can see that we have started the virtual machine. From here, we have to select the language, the English US and the times and currency. We will say next. And the keyboard, it is US, you can select any keyboard. Next, select whether we will install Windows 11 or we will repair our PC. Okay, we will select install Windows 11. I agree. Next, here if we have product 
fields, we have to render it, otherwise if you don't have it, we will select I don't have a callback field. From here, we have to select the version. We will select Windows 11 Pro for workstation. Next. Yeah, accept. This is the best ETGB's drive that we have specified for this installation. We even we can create for patient. So it is okay. We will select this this and next. Here you can see ready to install and install. Yes, when the windows are almost installed, so here we have to select the region as I am in India. I will select India. Now we have to select keyboard layout. If you want to add more layout, so you can add other voice, you can skip it. We have to select the name for our device. We will name it as Virtual Machine Dream. Next. Here we have to select whether we will set up for a personal use or we will set up for what is going to be select set up for personal use. Okay friends, here we have to sign in with our Microsoft account. Okay. Here we have to create a pen. Accept. Here, as I have logged in with the same account that this PC, so here we will go for more option. And here we will select setup as new PC. Here we will skip it. Yes, you can see that Windows 11 has been installed on virtual box. Now, there is only one option left get the windows for full screen so for this one we will simply click on device and there it gives additional CD image then we will open file explorer then you can see CD drive 
we will simply click on virtual box window edition virus administrator yes next next and we have to restart our computer we will reboot our computer yes to check the version of this windows simply we will search for one word and here you can see that we have successfully installed 24 h2 of the things to windows 11 24 h2 this was all for today's video in the next video we will try to install mac operating system or Linux operating system on a virtual box. Thank you.